are kicking off this North Center celebration with the Bad Apple, where everything is made from scratch, from the pickles to ketchup. Oh, and Ke owner Kevin O'Hara and executive chef Pedro Escalante join us now in our Studio 41 kitchen with a look at the menu. Gentlemen, thank you for being here. Thank, oh, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Looks, it smells delicious. And you're saying from scratch, from the everything. We make everything, every sauce, every dressing. We have real smokers in house. Ooh. We, you see some restaurants, they get buns like from the big providers. I have a local bakery, extra butter in the brioche. It's, we do everything top notch. Okay, and, and, and this one here, <laughs> it really sounds very interesting. So this is Elvis's Last Supper? Elvis's Last Supper. We thought Pedro could make that for you. It's one of our most unique burgers. So uh, Pedro's going to cut up some plantains for us here. Mm. Okay. And once he cuts them up, he's going to put them in a pan. We mix a little oil, a little bit of water, and then we add some brown sugar, some butter, a little bit of salt, some nutmeg, and some cinnamon. It sounds a little bit like a banana's foster. It is. You have to have a little bit of yeah. sweet to kind of cut down because the burger's a little fatty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to add a little twist at the end with a little ah. pepper jelly that we make in house as well. So. Oh, very nice. And for people that don't understand, Elvis loved peanut butter and bananas. Absolutely. And he so did. this is kind of where this all came from. Yeah. And so you get a plantain that's a little bit ripe. It's got a little bit of black on it. Mm -hmm. Adds a little bit of sugar to it, and then okay. it caramelizes up super nice. So Pedro's got now some butter. Yeah. Some, some butter. Some. Um, I mean, absolutely. I mean, after a few minutes, after we, uh, you know, let it cook in for a few minutes, mm -hmm. you, we flip it, and then we add all these ingredients, and after that, that's all the result that we... Now, do plantains hold ahead. up better than bananas? Is that why you use plantains? Yes. They do. Yeah, okay. And yes. so is this a ripe... Um, this plantain. is a ripe plantain. Okay, so it's really we sweet. We have to at make that sure point. like it's a ripe plantain. Okay. In order to get this result. Oh, that This looks is what good. we get. Okay. So we're just gonna uh, build in. Like our Elvis. The Elvis. So through the magic of TV, we yeah. cook our burgers obviously on a grill, so we don't oh, have a grill. So every we've single got it all set. On a grill? Every single burger's oh. on a grill. So we use we use Pat Lafrida beef. So we get it shipped in twice a week from New York, and mm -hmm. we, sh we even ship it in nitrogen so it doesn't oxidize. Oh, oh wow. So it's the best that you can get. We make our house-made peanut butter, which oh. Pedro's putting on there yeah. now. That's oh, and, sort of a labor of love as well. I was going to say, yeah. that's a generous amount of peanut butter right there. Yeah. <laughs> got to have it stick to the roof yeah. of your yeah. mouth there. Exactly. <laughs> Oh, okay. man. All right, and we're just going to add the, our bacon. Bacon, oh, bacon. yeah. This bacon good. makes everything taste yep. better. Mm -hmm. yeah, and after that, we're just going to add it, the, the plantain. Mm. Wow. So this is some sweet and savory going on yep, here. It is. Get a little mix of everything with this. This is one of our more unique burgers. We do some different things and we add some different flavor combinations, but mm -hmm. you got to have something that's a little incredible and a little bit different. Yeah, Ooh. people need to be a little frightened by it but want to try Absolutely. it, right? Absolutely. Right. Most people say, I'm not sure, but then at the end they're like, I can't believe how great this was. Yeah. Okay. So you got other burgers over there um, that, you want, that, that you can tell us about. Okay. Absolutely. So this is our standard bad apple burger. So okay. wonderful palafrida beef with the pickles that we make in house. This is our thunder. Dome. That, okay, oh, wait, wait, yeah. wait, wait, wait. Let's start over again. We didn't get a chance to get a sure. look at it. Okay, so once again, that's... So this is our bad apple burger. So okay. it's got our house-made pickles. It's got uh -huh. our Pat Lafrida beef. It's got all the wonderful things that you want in a burger. Mm -hmm. The second one is our Thunderdome. Yeah. When that hits the table, cameras come out without yeah. a doubt. This is the one that people like to talk about. So we have braised short rib on top <gasps> of our burger. So that takes four and a half hours just for us to make the braised short rib. Three giant onion rings we make in-house. Then we do a horseradish cream on top of that Yum. as well. It is, it's an amazing amazing burger. Mm -hmm. However, my favorite burger of all time at the moment, that's the Jake and Elwood. So oh. you have to be a certain age yeah, yeah, to understand yeah. the Jake yeah. and Elwood yeah. reference, the of course. Brother, that's yeah. exactly right. And so we house cure our own buckboard bacon. And so that takes two and a half weeks. Oh. Then we smoke the bacon in house. And then we add molasses and onions and some secret spices. And we make what is, honestly, it's the world's greatest thing ever on a burger. Wow. Okay. And then triple cream cambazola cheese on top, which Ooh. is super creamy. A little arugula for pepper. It's a, it's the best burger you've ever eaten. That I put I put my name fantastic. on it without a doubt. Okay, right, we have to try this. <clears throat> yeah, and as you're getting ready to cut this up for us, you saw you also have like 137 different beers on tap. We do. Yes. We have 25 yes. on tap, 135. Oh, in total. In, oh, okay. In total. We rotate a number of them, mm -hmm. and and again, our most exciting thing that we have going on is we have a new restaurant opening as well. Uh, breaking like restaurant to, news. Yes, breaking yes. restaurant news here. So uh, that'll be open at the end of the summer. So that restaurant will have 50 beers on tap, probably the largest beer selection in the city of Chicago, if not the state. So. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is the, the, the chili this jelly. Is the, this is the chili jelly. Oh, wow. wow. I, mean, this I is made a it because. It's a messy burger, mm. too. Isn't yeah. It? Yep. You, where, you give bibs with people while they're eating those? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. 
Bad Apple. <laughs> How'd you come up with that name? Yeah. A lot of people ask where the name comes from. I've got dragons in the building. I've got a, a restaurant named Bad Apple. The good thing is when you own a restaurant, you can do anything you want. Yeah. You know, anything you want. Okay. I like dragons. Dragons bad, come bad in. Bad Boy Burgers, maybe? That's, you can do, you there know. There you go. I like that. <laughs> can we cut sure. this? Yeah, cut it up. We're going to try and Ooh, take a bite of that. Of that. Alyssa definitely wouldn't eat this because oh, this is no. full of condiments. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get her to try our ketchup. I, I okay, think I, think I can win her over. I, I really do. Oh, wow. wow. Look at that. That oh, looks so good. You're going to need nine napkins. Yeah, you are. Okay. Oh, I don't even know how to. Uh, okay. like, how do you get in there? Like, where do, how do we get in here? Yeah, I think you have to do the Chicago hunch. The, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> mmm. Wow, mm. that's good. Mm -hmm. I like the jam. It's got a it's, lot of stuff going mm -hmm. on here. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, Kevin, Pedro. Mm, so this good, This is guys. delicious. Mm -hmm. Elvis had something going there. <laughs> Thank you all for joining us The Bad Apple. So we're on Lincoln Avenue. All of this is in North Center, by the way. Social media handles as well as the website, badapplebar.com. It's hard to talk with peanut butter. Don't think about that. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.